we begin with uh, the herald's journey to the court. And to begin with, we begin with the time when we were using the word Allah. And we have been using the word Allah for uh, a number of years uh, uh, in the herald, in the Malay section. Don't get it confused with some, as some people do, that we are using the word Allah in the English section. Not at all. It is in the Malay section of our weekly herald that we use the word Allah. Now, we, we had no difficulty for a long time, and then it became a difficulty. We were given uh, a letters of reminders and warnings saying that we cannot use the word Allah. And so we began to correspond with the government officials saying that we uh, we need to use the word Allah be, because it is in our Bible, in our prayer books, and also in our uh, earlier writing materials. And we told them this, and it is also a cultural heritage of us who speak the Malay language. So when we took, when we went to the court in 2007, we did not get um, the whole process going very quickly. So it was, uh, uh, it was difficult. Then, um, then the, the, so we then started again in, uh, we applied for a new case in 2008. And that went on with a lot of interventions and, and so the case prolonged quite a bit and then at the end of 2008 we felt that our, we were asking, uh, we were challenging the minister's order in, in not allowing us uh, to use the word Allah had already expired with the 2008 permit. So what we did was we then again applied the third time to the court uh, in 2009, that is last year, and that is the that's that court case that we applied is the one that brought us the the verdict that we can use on the last day of uh, December. Uh, court say the court says to us that uh, the that it's it it's quashed the decision of the uh, the home ministry and thus giving us the um, permission to use the word Allah uh, uh, as, as not the permission, but pro it, it squashes the prohibition of the government so that we can use the word Allah. So that has been uh, that. And since then, a lot of other things began to take place, uh, reactions from a small group of people, not, if, not all the Muslims of Malaysia were up there throwing uh, petrol bombs or Molotov cocktail on churches. No, not at all. A few people who have come around to do this. And uh, we are saddened by that. You know, why do we need this? If there is a real grievances about this, let us work it, talk it out. We had the court to challenge this. But in the court, we were not, the, the challenge was not great. There was not enough evidences. In the court, we provided a lot of evidences. Evidences that tell us uh, that what we told, we were able to tell that the, we were using the word Allah from 16, uh, before 1631 with a clear uh, evidence of a dictionary printed in 1631, a Malay Latin dictionary, when there was no dictionary at all in this country. We were able to show that. And not only that, we were also able to show books, prayer books and so on, um, written in very old Malay with the word Allah in this. And so that uh, word Allah in, a, in the very old language shows, indicates that it is not a book that we borrowed from Indonesia or another, but it is truly a local Malay. Malay was been the, the lingua franca of this part of the world. Now, Allah, as we know, predates Islam. Allah is also a word, Allah is also the word in Aramaic, the, the, the word that 
the language that Jesus used and also the language the word that Jesus would have used and so when when we have this kind of a situation what are we doing when what what is being done to us when we are told that the word Allah cannot be used this is a gross injustice and this is why we challenge the government for its injustice towards us we sing the word we sing our national anthem Nigaraku and one former minister says uh, the word Tuhan is for uh, Christians and the word Allah is for Muslims so when it comes to uh, Nigaraku the Muslims cannot sing Nigaraku anymore so to whom does the nation belong to <laughs> so you know this is is irrational it doesn't make sense and so this is a case where uh, we, we say there is uh, an, an agenda that, that is only good to say there is an agenda to divide the people.